Hello everyone. Welcome to my reading aloud session. Today I'm going to read to you Alfie's Shop. It is written by Shirley Hughes. Here we go. Welcome to Alfie's World. Alfie is an ordinary little boy. He has a mom and a dad and a little sister called Annie Rose. He has no magical powers and he does not go to fantastic journeys into space or anything like that. But some very exciting and interesting thing happens to him all the same. Annie Rose is only just learning to talk, but she knows how to get what she wants. If, if she is in a good mood, she and Alfie play games together. The house where Alfie lives stands in the rope houses which look rather the same on the outside. But inside, they are all very different. And so are the people that live in them. All the houses have back garden. In Alfie's back garden, there was a big bush. You could lift up a curtain of leaves and walk inside. It was a nice private place. One afternoon, Mom gave Alfie a long cardboard box to play with. He took it into the bush and put it down on its side. It made a good counter for a shop. Then, Alfie and Annie Rose looked around the garden for something to sell in the shop. They found plenty of things lying about. Flower petals, seed pods, acorn cups and lots of different kinds of leaves. They laid them out on the counter using some very big leaves as plates. They pretended they had vegetable and crisp and sweets and ice creams in their shop. Not the kind you can really eat, of course. And toys too. When everything was nicely arranged, Alfie decided that what the shop needed now was some money. He patched a little brown box with a lid and they collected a lot of flat greenish yellow seeds which rattled about inside like real money. Mom and Grandma were sitting in the garden having a cup of tea. Alfie asked them if they were coming to buy something at the shop. Yes, of course, said Grandma. But what's the name of your shop? Is it the Alfie and Annie Rose General Stores? No, said Alfie. It's called Lewis Barros and Company. He knew that there was a proper shop called that in the high street. Alfie put on his peak cap to open up the shop, and Annie Rose wore an apron to be Mr. Lewis Barrow's lady assistant. Then, Grandma and Mom came by to do some shopping. First, they bought cabbages and ice cream. Then, they bought lettuce and crisp, and a model helicopter and doll's tea set. Mr. Lewis Barrow's took the money and counted out the change, and his assistant handed things over the counter. The shop stayed open all afternoon. When it was time to go indoors, Mom made a notice and fixed it with a piece of string so that Alfie could hang it up outside the shop. On one side it said, open, but when you turned it around it said, closed. Even Mr. Lewis Barrows has to go to bed sometime, I expect, said Mom. That's, that's all for today. Thank you. Till next time. Goodbye.